are you are you sure about this? I mean, sure, Zach. Come on, I, I've got ten years on you. Oh, this is a terrible idea, you know. But that doesn't mean I'm still not in charge here, little girl. <sighs> okay. Listen to me. If you want this, <sighs> fuck. <laughs> I'm in so much trouble now. Hey, sure sack. Good out for a little old me. <laughs> mm, look at you. It's damn good to see you. <laughs> it's good to, to see you, sweetheart. Uh, I just wish, you know, it was under better circumstances. <laughs> How are you holding up, sure sack? I know, I know, sweetie. God, I'm so sorry. None of us expected your old man's health to deteriorate like that. Hmm? Certainly not that fast. Hey, look at me. I got here as far as I could because I knew this was going to be hard on you. I've told the rest of your family that they best stay away while we sort this mess. I know how they can be, and they also know how I can be if I get pissed enough. <laughs> They'll have real pretty eyes, your sec. <laughs> oh, you're going to make me blush, which is a fit at my age. Yeah, I know, I, I'm not that old compared to your dad, but I still got to take it on you, put him up. That classifies me as a proper old man, no? Ah, uh, you know, I guess I get how it feels to be the youngest in a group of old farts. <laughs> Though, it's all relative. Come on, let's get to sorting all of these ghosts. <laughs> oh god, another box full of empty bottles, hmm? What was that sure sec? Did he talk about you at all before he passed? Hmm. Yeah. He did. I mean, please don't make me repeat any of the awful things he said, sweetheart. I can say I'm proud of and that I've fought him again. Even after all these years, but to be fair, he threw the damn glass of whiskey between my eyes first. Then took a swing at me. Bastard could still scrap. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I guess the fight you learn in the military never really leaves, huh? Did you hear how about a bull broke out from the local parade last year? Yeah, and how some muscle brainer idiot punch said bull in the face. <laughs> yeah, like I said, the fight never leaves you. I'm kinda glad for it, to be honest. <sighs> I know I didn't come into your life until you were 18, sure stack, and I came in hearing how your father talked about you with no other frame of reference. You know, it kills me that I scuff off so many of those red flags. How many times I heard, oh, she's just being rebellious, or you know how girls can be. <laughs> uh, sweetheart, there's no way I'm never going to blame myself. I knew your old man could be a right bastard in even the best situations, and I guess being in his squad made the non-physical atrocities seem a little less harsh, I reckon. 
Hmm. How have I been? Well, I... Same, really. I still just... I'm not... <laughs> trying to take it one day at a time. Work on wood cutting and do some boxing down at the gym. <laughs> been on any dates? Hey, hey, you know. You stop. Always some them knows you about my non existent love life. <laughs> yeah, it is still non existent. Listen, I am happy with my own company for now. I mean I miss parts of being in a relationship, but considering the last one ended with her mistaking my older brother's junk for my own, I think I can live without drama for a bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, book fun for years that I need to stop running in like some night in Kamar more to protect folks. Hey, hand me that box over there. Yeah, that's the one full of all the um, racially charged letters he wanted to send to the congressman. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna. <sighs> gonna toss them into the fire except for the ones you asked me to save in case his lawyer tried to do any more slandering hey come here sweetheart I got you sure stuck uh, it kills me that you suffer in silence all those years Fucking kills me that even with me is done in there. Right fucking next to you at that stupid family gathering. They still came down on you for being some kind of healing when all you ever wanted was peace. Hey. I'm here. I have you sure stuck, okay? Don't worry. <laughs> lean, lean down. <laughs> All right. Mm. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> what the hell are you doing, kissing me? Hmm? <laughs> are you Are you sure about this? I mean, sure, is that come on. I I've got ten years on you. I've, I watched you grow from a sweet sassy girl that got dumped at prom and needed some dumb soldier to rescue you to an incredible young woman absolutely laying fools out left and right breaking hearts <laughs> am I afraid you'll break my heart? <laughs> yeah I'm terrified. <sighs> but that doesn't mean I'm still not in charge here, little girl. Uh, was that a swoon? Sure, a second. Hmm. Let me guess. Been dreaming of this big strong arms around you for years. <laughs> I didn't I did not read your diary, but I did become fascinated by your book collection and your spicy covers. Started reading my copies and oh, notice some recurring things. We'll say big strong arms the boys in charge French for some reason <laughs> I mean can't help you with that one unfortunately and don't ask me to fake the accent please <laughs> oh, this is a terrible idea you know I don't know the age differences already <laughs> plus your old man let my damn platoon Okay, 
Listen to me. Please. I want this. But I am terrified. Uh, so I'll get out. Any, any feelings didn't set in until you were damn near done with college. But I... I don't know how to navigate a relationship with someone I love as much as I do you. If you want this, you'll have to be patient with me, okay? <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm in so much trouble now. Ah, oh, please tell me that there isn't a red car in the driveway. Fuck me. Ah, oh, that means Uncle Jim's is here. Come on, short sack. I need to get you to the safe room. Damn it, go. Okay? And get ready to call the cops if you hear it escalating. Hey, Jim. Bro, you're gone this time? 